<laughs> All right. Thank you for calling KFC. How can I help you today? Hello there. I got a problem with the restaurant that I went to. All righty. Well, I would love to help you with that. Let me get just a little bit of information from you, if you don't mind. First of all, I love your chicken. It's beautiful. Oh, great. Always just right. Perfect. And I love the mashed potatoes with the gravy on them. Right. Sometimes I like to mix it up real good and drink it. That's how good I like it. Right. Yes, sir. Good stuff. The coleslaw is great, and the biscuits are delicious. Yes, sir. Well, you need to work on the hats you give out, because they're too tight, and I'm stuck in one. Hats? I didn't know we did hats. The hats that the chickens come in there. I finished it, and I put on my hat, and now I can't get it off. Uh-oh. You should think about the people with large ears, like myself. All right, I agree. I will definitely put in for them to have bigger buckets. And now I can't get it off my head, though. And I'm dialing with my feet. Maybe you come by here and get this off of my head. I wish I could, but our roads are super icy, and so I, I don't think I'm going to be going anywhere. They are? I can't tell because I got a hat on my head that I can't see anything with right now. I'm bumping into everything. Oh my goodness, I... And my head smells like chicken. Um, could I get your first name, please? Elma Higgins is my name. Usually I get the three piece. Last night I went wild. Oh dear. And I woke up this morning with a hat all over my face. And now I got chicken in my ears. Well, I do apologize. I think they're made out of uh, paper, aren't they? It's not your fault, darling. Um, so I will definitely put in a request. It's whoever made these crazy hats. Right. I, I completely understand. I will definitely put in your suggestion for the bigger bucket. And there's an echo um, in here, too. Is there anything else I could assist you with? Anything other than I got a bucket stuck on my head? No. And I, I certainly do apologize. Um, they should be paper, so you should be able to rip it easily. Uh, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to drive to the store, and maybe they can do it for me over there. All right. Well, if you've got a bucket or a, a hat on your head, I would definitely be careful driving. Oh, all right. I'm getting accidents all the time. It's okay. I'm 85 years old. Was there anything else KFC-related that I could help you with? You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to try to get into my car. And I'm going to start driving over to your place. All righty. Well, sir, thank you so much for... I'll bring you some chicken. Well, thank you. Hold on. Maybe if I push against the chair, I can get this off. Uh... <clears throat> Ow. Are you okay? Uh, I got good news and bad news. And what's the good news? I'm out of the hat, but I'm stuck in a lampshade. Oh, no. I'm sorry to hear that. I'm going to drive over there now. So that's, um, that's probably not a good idea. I'm getting in my car now. Sir. Okay, chicken lady. See you soon. Where the hell is the steering wheel? <laughs> she was so nice. 